Hello everyone and welcome back with me Life as a Cat and today what we are going to be doing in this video is I'm going to be teaching you, yes you, how to give your tortoises a bath. I'm sorry that this isn't really like an extravagant vlog. I don't know if you can tell, I feel like I sound it but... I haven't been feeling all that great. Like I've been having a runny nose and stuffy nose and just been feeling a little bit congested. But anyways, I hope you guys enjoy the video. Okay, so what I recommend is getting an empty gallon of water and you fill it up with the perfect amount of temperature water for your tortoises. That way you don't have to keep on going back and forth between the sink. You just have a big gallon right there. And you gotta make sure that your water is the right temperature. You don't want it too cold or too warm. And bro, look at my arm holding this, bro. I need to go back to the gym for real. <laughs> don't hit arms. But yeah, really make sure the temperature is good. Don't want it too warm. Don't want it too cold. <laughs> and then... You fill up the bin, and I usually fill it up about an inch because, again, you don't want to be drowning your tortoises in water, so you don't want to fill it up too high, so I usually fill it up about an inch. This is kind of how much I fill it up. <laughs> and then you grab a toothbrush to scrub them with. Oh! Somebody! Oh! Ow, bro. Scrubbing them helps with their shedding and also it just helps get all the excess dirt off that they don't need on them, on their shells. And then it's time to grab the tortoises. Rise and shine. Oh. <laughs> Yo, oh my god. You're Sorry, done. I didn't need to scare you. Oh no, no. This, this, this can't be. Hello. I'm sorry. Don't be hissing at me, bruh. Help me! Help! No, God, please, no! No! Okay, y'all, so I got both of my tortoises in here. I'm like right here. Hey guys, I don't know. Yeah, you can see me. You my Ashley at hand, bro. Dang, all right. I, at least I just exposed myself so y'all don't have to do a for me on God. So both of my tortoises are in here. This is Tulip, this is Talia. And I have to face them back to back or else they'll start fighting each other if I don't. So, isn't that cuteness right there? But anyways, I'm Put those grippers away! You Don't look at my foot. Oh my god. I have this toothbrush. So what I usually do is I just let them like chill for a second. You know, get used to the temperature. They hate baths, so I just let them get used to it. And I'm seeing that I could put a little bit more water in here. Yeah, I'll put a little bit more in there. I just don't ever want to like start drowning them on God. So I'm gonna put like a little bit of water in. Yeah, that should do because Talia's the like smaller tortoise, so like I have to go by how high the water can go before she can't breathe. So I'm gonna get this toothbrush ready. I'm just gonna let them adjust. They don't adjust well, they don't like the water, but look at them like try to scramble out now. Exactly, so oh my god. I'm really sorry for how gross I sound too. Like it is so bad. I just got my toothbrush and I just basically, I'm gonna let them soak for a little bit and then I just basically like dip the toothbrush into the water and then I just like scrub them off a little bit. They were like so dirty though. They were like literally so dirty. So, hi! I know you can't really see their faces. You know, I might take this off so you guys can actually like see them better, I feel like. The only reason I have this on is because they like to climb out of this thing. Ignore how disgustingly dusty this is. But they like to like climb out, especially Tulip because she's bigger. But since I'm right here, I can take this off for now. So you guys can see them better. It's like nice and peaceful for me until one of them ends up like pooping or peeing in the water. Now I'm just going to dip it in here while we have like clean water right now. And I'm just going to oh. Have you ever had a dream that, that you, um, you had... Oh, um, I can't talk either. All right, so I'm just gonna start scrubbing them. So what I usually do is, I'm so sorry, but I like have to pour water on top of them in order to do this properly. So I have to like, I know they hate this, but. Oh my God, that was a lot. Bro, I'm so sorry. But it's like, I have like a whole jug. I can't pour like a tiny bit. I gotta do it to you too. Watch out, watch out. Okay. scrub all of their body to make sure like all the dirt's off them even though they're about to get right back in the dirt because that's how they live but and I see you can see like little fart bubbles I don't know if you can tell but that's how you know something's about to go down 
scrubbing. I'm scrubbing Talia first because I feel like she's more, a little bit more, well actually, they're kind of both not cooperative when it comes to this. <laughs> oh, there you go. No, Talia, please. I see her tail moving. Please, ain't no way you poop right now, bro. I just got you in the water. Did you pull it back in? <laughs> Did you? I hate having to change the poopy water after. That's like the worst part of this whole thing. <laughs> But yeah, I just scrub their shells first, just on top, make sure all the dirt's off. And I've had these, I've had these torn, oh my god, you can see my hand the whole time. It was probably like so scary at looking. Anyways, I've had these tortoises for about, um, I got them, I'm trying to remember. This year is going to be their ninth year living with me. So, I've had them for almost a decade. Yo, Tully, I swear, no! Her tail. She pooped in the water, and I know you see it. Now I gotta go, we didn't even last, how long do we last? I have it on recording. We lasted like six minutes, bro. We didn't even, uh, uh. Do any of, do you gotta poop too, too little before I start, you're farting, bro. Just poop because yeah, ain't no way I'm going out there, and then y'all gotta poop again. Yeah, but if you have tortoises, just know that they're gonna poop a lot in the water as you do this. Because the water just like makes their tummy go rumble. <laughs> I'm gonna go change the water and I'll be right back because I know y'all don't wanna keep on seeing poop floating around and I don't either, so. Ew, it's so gross. I hate this, bro. I'm gonna put y'all in here for like literally five seconds. Do not climb out. Do you hear? You heard? You heard? Guys, can you watch my tortoises for me? <laughs> be like one of those TikToks, guys. Can you watch my tortoises for me? Like, it's literally gonna be like 10 seconds, bro. I swear, if you climb out of this bowl right now, I'm gonna lose my mind. <laughs> Yo, Tulip, I swear to God, if you climb out right now, we're not besties, okay? Uh-oh, I gotta go quick. Y'all, watch my tortoises for me, okay? Watch them. Make sure she doesn't climb out. Lords, if you start crawling on these floors, my mom would kill me, bruh. <laughs> you you wash them perfectly. Oh my god, my nose hurts so bad, guys. Like, you don't even understand. It is like raw. <laughs> Alright, so I just cleaned out their bowl, and what I basically do is I just pour out the poopy water and then I just rinse it. And then basically I just put some new water in back to the, like the same amount of height. And I just put them right back in. So I just basically, I'm still gonna keep on wiping her shell until like most of the dirt's off. Like it's not all gonna come off, but you wanna get like some of it. And then once like, oh my god, they're little noise. They make like little hissing noises. I don't. You probably can't even hear it, but I kind of make a little hiss noise. Okay, but once I'm like done scrubbing the top of their shell pretty good, I just like scrub their like little skin, which what? I know is weird, but it helps like them shed a little bit more. So I just scrub it. I don't do it like too much because I don't know, but that's, that's a great answer. That's good. Ooh, that's good. But I just try to scrub their little like legs, and then I try to scrub their arms. Oh, I'm sorry, bro. She just started hissing at me. She did not like that, bro. They don't like this part, but like it has to be done. <laughs> I have to scrub your little armpits. Get here. And then I have to get your little forehead. Can I get your little forehead? Oh, hell no. Oh, no. Oh, no. I'm sorry. Okay, just one swipe. <laughs> That's all they're gonna really allow you to do anyways. And then I scrub both of their like tails and under after they're all scrubbed. So now it's Tulip's turn. Tulip is this one. You could kind of tell their patterns on their shells are different and then like, I don't know, I've, I've had them for nine years as I said so I can just tell them just by looking at them. Like Talia's like darker, like she's more black. <laughs> Talia got a little, definitely a little seasoning to her compared to Tulip. Talia's smaller than Tulip. You guys can see, right? Maybe I should flip it this way so you can see better. Can you see that better? Oh my god, I should have had it this way the whole time. Oh, okay, I'm sorry guys. I should have had it this way the whole time literally. Boom. We're just gonna scrub a little shell. She's not as dirty as Talia, bro. Like she's not, at least not as I can see. Bro, why are you climbing on Talia, 
it, bro. Oh my god. Well, you see this? Like, bro, why are you climbing on her? What did she do? Here, get into it. Get a little scrub, scrub, dub. Bro, you're moving this water a little too much, though, bro. Create a turbulence in here, bro. Create a whole whirlpool. I just have to scrub her little legs and then I scrub their little arms, get their armpits, <laughs> you know, and get in there. I like don't even know at this point what I just did. Oh my god, there's like splashing water everywhere. <gasps> Someone pooped in here again. Oh, I know you see that. Who did it this time? Talia again? Talia, bro. And oh now god. there's like poop stuck to your butt too, bro. Ugh. Brother, ugh. What's that? Sitting here and contemplating for real. I'm just gonna finish scrubbing Talia's like forehead a little bit. She's more cooperative when it comes to this. Okay, scrub your little neck. Okay, they're really not gonna let you get their head, really. Bro, Talia, bro. I need to cheers for you from this to that bin. And if some poop comes off your butt and gets on this carpet, my mom gonna whoop my booty cheeks, bro. So you need to get out that poop out your butt immediately, bro. Now y'all standing still in the water. Bro, whoa. Why is it like street? Bro had diarrhea. Ew! It's so nasty! I'm just a girl! Where is my tall brunette nerdy boyfriend to help me clean this out, bro? Bro! Ew! And it smells bad. Yeah! Okay. Oh my god, I thought I just I thought the poopy toothbrush landed on me, bro. I was about to start tweaking. Please, tulip. You know what? I'm not even I'm facing you this way, bro. Because you're not- Oh my god, don't use Talia to climb out though. Oh my god, 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 oh my god. There's a lot going on. Hey! Hey! We don't have to choose. I just poured some new water in here. So now we can transfer them back. I just have to scrub their underside. Do this, I just scrub their little underside. Look at them. You just pick them up. They both hate being picked up, but you know. And then you get their little tail right here, so you just kind of scrub. Okay, now poopy yeah. Talia's turn. Yeah, bro! Their wet skin feels so gross, bro. Okay. Ah! And she like fights back more. Me just and I. Oh, T Talia, bro! You almost made me drop you. All right. Ah! Tool gotta move, bro. So I just scrub their underside. And go like. Yeah, she hides her tail, bro. It's kind of hard to get in there, but you gotta like get in there somehow. And then you just kind of get their underside like this. Yeah, that's how I just scrub them off. This poopy toothbrush will not, th this will be thrown out. This will not be going anywhere. Throw your toothbrushes out, please, if you scrub your tortoises, bro, please. Do not keep them. And then I just dry them off. I don't have a towel for them, so I don't know how this is gonna work. And guys, do not use your towels that you use for yourself on your tortoises. Please don't do that. That's so nasty, bro. I'm gonna get Talia first, cause she's least cooperative when it comes to this. <laughs> So I have two paper towels. Usually I would use like a regular towel, but we don't have any more tortoise towels because they pooped in it. So if they poop in your towel, please throw it out. But I'm using a paper towel. This is not going to help either, but you know, it does a little bit. So I just kind of wipe them. You know, wipe. <laughs> and then you know, clean. Now it's Tulip's turn. She's a little bit more cooperative when it comes to this. Okay, little arms. <laughs> get your underside. That's all I try to really get is their underside because that's where they collect the most dirt as soon as they go back in. Oh, then I just put her back in the tank. Usually I like to give them a little treat afterwards, giving them their bath. Today I gave them carrots. Usually I would give them like berries because they really like raspberries or blackberries and they only get to have them once in a while. But we didn't have any so I just gave them carrots. They love carrots as well. And look at Tulip right here investigating the carrot bro. Just a little treat because I know how much they hate the bath, truly. Like they do are not water people. <laughs> they fight over the bath as you can clearly tell. <laughs> But yes, also please guys remember to wash your hands so good. And I'm talking about so good. Make sure to get like all in between your fingernails, your wrists, literally every single part of your hands that touch the tortoises because tortoises carry diseases and you don't want anything to get on you too. So make sure you clean off really good. That way you don't catch anything. <laughs> Looking out for y'all. And then yeah, here's just them burrowing after the bath. That's what they usually like to do, just to tan under the light. And yeah, 
that's it. All right, guys, so I'm going to end the video here. If you like this video, make sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe if you are new. And hit that bell notification. It tells me I have a new video out. Comment if you're new. Tell your friends about me to send fan art. The email will be in the description down below. I hope you have an amazing day, and I will see you all later. Peace.